According to our the DOT calendar, we have a 17,000 soul solo event here for Totec. Unless we appease the god's anger with a human sacrifice. Ah, don't worry. We got a guy here who's really good with math. Is it you? <laughs> Not me, that guy. Hey guys, how's it going? Dark Shigong, Gaming on the Dark Side, coming at you with the latest episode, episode 12 of Can I Do This Event for Free? This week, we will be talking about Totec. That's our Monday through Wednesday event this week. We've got a new Totec. His prestige is reskilled. Um, he comes with a new synergy relic. And the event's only 17,000 souls, so that's not too bad. So let's get into the numbers and see. Can we do this for free? But don't forget, guys, before we get started, hit that like button. Definitely comment. helps out with the YouTube algorithm. And if I earn it, hit the subscribe button. Thanks. So before we get into the numbers, guys, don't forget, I do not factor in Portal Stone refresh rate. The Portal Stone reward drops. If you take longer than 30 seconds for your ping pong attack time, that's going to change the numbers a bit. And I don't count the boost relics for two stars, three stars, or four stars. Everything's based off a one star roll. So things of these are guesstimates to kind of give you like kind of a worst case scenario or maybe like a maximum of what you're looking at and minimum. So, you know. Use math accordingly, see where you fit in, see if you have enough stuff saved up to do these events. Oh, Shigo, can you explain those numbers in simple terms for us? Of course I can. All right, so we take your saved relics, your saved gems. I'm going to divide it over here by how many souls in the event, carry the 10, and that looks like it'll be about mm, 14,000 gems. And about 10 hours of grinding. Starting off with the pure grind, not using any relics at all, with a 1.4 boost type, which I'm glad they have a 1.4 boost. You're looking at about 1,200 battles that get this thing completely done. It's about 3,000 portal stones. It's gonna cost you about 14,970 gems. However, if you buy those gems today, they are 25% off, guys. And it'll take you about a 10 hour grind over the course of the next two days. Now, if you're just saving up relics for the next major event, whether it's Sekhmet coming up this weekend or possibly next weekend's huge event with Equinox, the Finish Plus event, well, and with the Corrupted Militias coming out, don't forget that. Well, then you might want to just go for the minimum where you get three tokens. In this event, it's only 1,500 souls. That's going to take you 108 battles, about 274 portal stones if you want to knock that out fast. Now, um, if you just use portal stone refresh and the included gems and all that kind of stuff in there, you should probably get this done pretty close to free, but not exactly. But it'll take about you know, less than an hour to grind this out, get three tokens. So for the price of a thousand gems, you're going to get 6,000 gems worth of value. And who knows what those could be. You might be lucky and get four star relic rolls in the event of your choice, which would be a huge return on investment for a thousand gems. Just keep that in mind, guys. 1,500 souls is a great minimum to hit for this event and you know to place somewhere, maybe get some better gems, all that good stuff. Now, if you don't care about saving up relics and you want to use the five included relics in this, we're going to guess that we're only going to get one star rolls, right? Um, with the 1.4 boost Titan, you're looking at a little under 1,100 battles to get this done. So going to cost you about 2,600 portal stones, which is about 12,810 gems, however. Portal Stones are on sale, so it will actually will be less than that if you buy them today. Um, and about a nine hour grind. So like I said, you can kind of divvy that up over the course of the next, um, uh, what, 48 hours or so. And um, so it's not gonna kill you to go straight through. But if you wanna go straight through, it's nine hours out of your day. And you got yourself a brand new Totec, brand new Synergy, um, dropping some Corrupted Imperials and Grenadiers. One last thing before I jump into the worst case scenario. Um, if you do have better rolls than a one star, use this handy little chart to kind of gauge um, what the reduction in the overall cost and time, portal stones, gems, and souls it will be. I got I broke it down here for the one star, two star, three star, and four star boost relics. Um, the souls per relic is based on unstacked. So if you stack your relics, you will lose out on a few souls here and there. But you can make up those by just grinding more past your relics. Um, if you want more information on that, just hit me up and I'll direct you to a video that kind of goes deeper into that if you need it. All right, now let's take a look at the worst case scenario. All right, guys, if your luck is as bad as mine was a few years ago in Vegas when I lost 
well, <laughs> I would say probably almost like a down payment on a house. Anyways, way too much money. I'm scared to gamble now. But if you were a gambler and you get nothing but one star rolls, this table is for you. It will take you 33 relics in order to finish this event, plus the five that's in there. So that's 38 rel relics total, 304 battles, 312 portal stones. And hey, you'll leave with 1,400 gems. I don't know if that's a good trade-off or not. I mean, you're looking about a two and a half hour grind, but that's like the maximum amount. So if you guys are asking how many relics do I have to have saved up? Well, if you want the worst case scenario, 33, and you can finish this event, guys. All right, so keep that in mind. Up to you. Totec is interesting. He's great for assault. Um, and also, well, she, he's a fun PP Titan. I'm not too sure if he's going to be meta or anything like that, but he is a war god. All right, guys, I will be out now. I just want to say thanks for joining me. I got to get ready for this weekend's event with Sekhmet coming up, and I'm looking forward to it. I already have one, but I wouldn't mind getting another one because she is annoying annoying to fight against so if i'm annoyed by her then i'm pretty sure other people don't like fighting her either i know i definitely avoid her all right all right all right well hey guys hopefully i'll catch you guys this weekend playing around um until i see you guys again this is dar shigong and i hope that when i do see you i'll catch you all gaming on the dark side